What's up, guys? Talk about uh, some jet lag. <clears throat> Went to sleep last night watching some Supernatural. Pretty normal. Um, for one, this couch here is a little too comfortable. So I don't even remember what happened in the episode. I'm gonna have to rewatch that one. But went to sleep maybe like 10, 10.30, and then I get up to use the bathroom, and it's freaking almost noon. So I haven't slept that long in, I can't even tell you when. But today's the day before the storm, or calm before the storm. Tomorrow starts training with Rich. Uh, I, was thinking about, I was thinking about going to Mayhem class later on this afternoon. I think they got like, uh, 4.30, 5.30, 6.30, or 5, 6, and 7. I forget. I'll just check their website again, but I'm going to get a little relaxation in, eat some food, and then get ready to train with Rich tomorrow. What's up, guys? Just getting a little warm-up in before we do a 5 o'clock class over here at, at Mayhem. Uh, just did my foot warm-up. The nice part is there's actually 20, 25 yards of turf to do it on. So just kind of stretching out my ankles slash my quads right now. Four o'clock class is finishing up. So there's a handful more equipment here than the last time I was here. Like you got more of the, uh, there's more pegboards on the wall and then the uh, that pulley system. I forget what it's called off the top of my head. Please somebody comment if they know what it is. And uh, yeah, got some front squats and uh, kind of a segregated DT for the workout today. So we'll see how it goes. to get a handful of mayhem gear good on myself I definitely have a t-shirt problem which reminds me when I moved in up in Kaneohe I kind of sort of counted all the shirts that I had and it was like 150 plus we actually kind of lost count but, but look at the retail space amazing and actually the thing that I'm super impressed with look at this On a couple of places in the floor so pretty excellent just finishing up our first full day here in cookville even though we slept into like new so going to dinner at father tom's pub only per my recovery so i don't like to per my recovery i don't like to you know tempt fate as they call it so i have still not been in a bar or legit pub in eh, a little more than three years, just as long as it's been since I, uh, since I got sober. But food is really good here, and literally it's walking distance to where we're staying at. I don't know if you can see, but right beyond those, uh, those trees over there is the entrance to the place that I'm staying at. So literally like a 15 second walk. Mm -hmm. 